Okay, <clears throat> beware of donation fraud from the left. I know many of you out there probably take donations on your videos or your sites. I don't really like the idea of it. I kind of tried a Patreon once, but <clears throat> I didn't like it. And then plus everybody was getting off of it because of the discrimination. So I'm like, I'll just leave. So, but basically you probably didn't think you could get in trouble for somebody donating to you. But I, the other day I heard about a case, a very extreme case, that shows that you receiving a donation from somebody could ruin your life. Okay. <clears throat> well, a lot of you watch my channel. You're probably also familiar with the other freedom fighters. You're probably familiar with um, Brittany Paybone and her um, fiancé, Martin Sellner. Well, the other day I saw the video. She said about how... When he was doing his taxes, he discovered that he had gotten an, a donation a year or so ago from an email address that sounded like the New Zealand shooter. So, of course, the, they, I guess they practically arrested him, or maybe they didn't arrest him, but they, his house was raided, and then the media found out about it, and they're like, oh, he's part of the problem, he's involved, ah. And you see, it's, well, it's ridiculous, because you can't control who donates to you. I said, that guy probably used Facebook and YouTube. Why don't we shut them down, too? Same with any other crime. But see, it seems, see, the left is very selective. They are very selective. They only go after people they want to go after for something stupid. And they don't go after the other sites. Because they're, like I said, they're, they're leftists. They're bad. And I have no qualms about saying that. It's fact. All right. So, so yes, you would normally think that you would not get your life destroyed, turned upside down because you got a donation from somebody. But with the left, this might be the case. Now, if, if he had received the donation recently, I would say that the left was perpetrating a fraud in order to take him down because he's a freedom fighter that opposes them. But since it was a year and a half ago, I mean, it very well could have been that individual. But at that point, he, the guy hadn't committed a crime. So there is no crime involved because there's no crime. Uh, no crime in 2018. There's a crime this year, but not last year. So therefore, the guy wasn't on a watch list or anything. And so the point is, do you want to take donations after this? Because I think this is a perfect opening for the left to start donation fraud in order to frame people to destroy them. If they're smart, they probably will. But, um, because, see, this is what a leftist could do. They could create an email account and use the name of some, you know, some really violent criminal or something. And then they could say, okay, we're going to give you a donation and use that email. And they could use it to, therefore, take out their political opponents. See? You know? So I think you should definitely be aware of these donations from now on. From now on. Especially those of you who are in political commentary. Because I think the left could try to make a donation to you and falsify a name to implicate you into some other kind of crime. So be very careful. And one time... I heard, this isn't really a crime, but this is a, a nasty leftist joke. There, my mom gets the Creation Science magazine, Ken Ham, and he said that somebody made a donation in their name to Planned Parenthood. I said, that's a nasty little thing, a nasty little trick. But see, that conservatives, this is what we need to do. We need to make donations to Christian groups, Christian evangelism, in the name of leftists. Don't we need to do that? Wouldn't that be awesome? And then they would probably just scream their heads off. They couldn't do a thing about it. Yes, so yes, Christians, let's make donations to conservative groups. Make donations to President Trump in the name of Hillary Clinton, you know? Wouldn't that be funny? That would be funny. But, so, so yeah, that's what we got to do. And the left, they can make all the donations to their uh, groups that they want and you and say they're doing it in for the conservatives, in the name of the conservatives. And we'll donate everything to the Christians in the name of the leftists. That would be fun. So that's what we need to do. 
But anyhow, so the point is, beware of donations. I said, I don't like to use them myself. I think I prefer to make my money through sales, like products, books. I don't like the donation model because the donation model makes me feel beholden. <clears throat> and I'd really rather just, just control my own money. So I don't want to do the donation bit. But you can see what kind of trouble a person can get into taking donations. All right. Let freedom ring.